The German government, led by Chancellor Olaf Scholz, announced a significant expansion of its military aid to Ukraine. Keeping its promise, Germany announced that new military aid had been sent to Ukraine. This new aid was announced on January 16, 2023. Germany has committed to providing Ukraine with military aid worth 7 billion euros, 7.6 billion dollars, for the year 2024. This support follows a series of previous contributions, including the transfer of Jeopard anti-aircraft vehicles, various military equipment, and ammunition in December 2023. On January 4, 2024, Germany had already announced a new aid package including Skynex air defense systems. But now a new package was announced on January 16, 2024. The newly announced package includes ammunition for Leopard 1 tanks, essential for Ukraine's offensive and defensive operations. Germany did not specify the type of tanks, but it is more than likely that these are the Leopard 1A5 tanks widely present in Ukraine. Adding 25 RQ-35 Hydron reconnaissance drones will enhance Ukraine's surveillance and reconnaissance capabilities, allowing for a better understanding of enemy movements and intentions on the battlefield. The eight armored personnel carriers included in the package will increase the mobility and protection of Ukrainian troops. Again, the exact model has not been specified by the German government. Furthermore, the package includes 16 Mercedes-Benz Zetros tanker trucks, which will play a crucial role in logistical support, particularly for refueling vehicles and military equipment in the field. The support for the Ukrainian border guard is also reinforced with five vehicles specifically intended for this purpose, in addition to three civilian vehicles that can be used for various support operations. The 50 SATCOM communication terminals are essential for maintaining reliable and secure communication lines, a vital element in modern military operations. The 500 LED lamps provided will help improve visibility conditions, especially in conflict zones where lighting is inadequate. In addition, the package contains materials for neutralizing explosive munitions, thus contributing to the safety of troops and civilians on the ground. Finally, the nearly 2000 M92 combat helmets will strengthen that the decision to increase military aid was influenced by the experiences of 2023 when the initially planned amounts were quickly exhausted. This led to doubling the aid for 2024, underlining Germany's commitment to supporting Ukraine's defense. The increase in aid also aligns with Germany's intention to meet NATO's 2% defense spending target in 2024, as part of its broader efforts to strengthen its military capabilities. This shift in Germany's military aid policy is part of a broader trend where the country has become one of the main supporters of Ukraine since the beginning of the conflict with Russia, contributing about 22 billion euros in humanitarian, financial, and military aid. The German defense company FFG is establishing a repair center in western Ukraine to service military equipment used by the Ukrainian armed forces. If Germany is intensifying its aid, it may also be to compensate for the lessening presence of U.S. aid, which could worsen with the upcoming presidential election depending on the elected candidate. If Ukraine wants to continue its fight against Russia, it must therefore find funding elsewhere than the U.S., with Germany being a good candidate but not having the finances to completely replace the United States. These developments highlight Germany's growing involvement in the conflict and its commitment to supporting Ukraine's defense capabilities. This also reflects a broader strategy of the German government to increase its military spending and play a more active role in international defense and security affairs.